All right, so the other day I was at Jay's house, and he had this land on his workbench. And it got to me thinking, man, I used to have one of these around. This is what we call a coon cuff. Just push the pan down. Turn off the And it basically ends up being almost like a regular long spring or coil spring trap and it's just a push down trigger, but it's in a DP style. What you gotta do is big a hole, bury this in it, put the bait down in there and hope that the coon pushes the trigger down when he goes to set. This is one of the old original DPs. Now, they're not really great, but got me thinking, and I, we used to have one of these. It was actually my brother bought it and it's been at my house forever and I found that thing. So I'm gonna set this one I borrowed, borrowed off Jay and the one I got and see if I can catch a coon using the coon, old coon cuffs. Uh, so the first thing you gotta do, dig a hole, preferably in the side of a bank. But it doesn't have to be in the side of a bank, but it helps. Big enough to bury this trap in. Then you want to try and get that hair, that trigger set as hair triggered as you can without getting your finger in there. That's why Jay told me I could borrow this. He says, I don't want that thing that tries to snap my finger every time I mess with it. Then you shove the dirt back around the trap. So that the inside of that hole is the uh, only place exposed. There we go. And since this is Jay's one, it doesn't have an earth anchor on it like mine well it does. I have to find somewhere to tie it off to that hopefully I don't lose my coon. I don't really like this, but this is what we're gonna do. bait you drop down inside of there whatever you're using for bait in this case I got a little tuna I drop down in there they don't like that at all and I sprinkle a few of my vanilla peas around it throw some in there throw some around here that lure some stuff in like where my bait fell. I don't want my finger. There we go. Get it in there. So at the end, this is what you have for a set. You can see the coon's supposed to take his hand down there to try and get the bait, push that trigger and he'll be stuck in there. Alright, so right here is where we had that coon cuff set made and see it's not here now so everything's tore up this is where I'd use the one with tie wire he's up in that mess there see the yellow tie wire I had on there the coon cuff and there's the coon up in there this is why I don't like uh, using tie wire I like my earth anchors because he could have easily got off once he got got up there and got a hold of some things but uh, luckily he didn't. So we're gonna have to dispatch him and get him out of there, get him untangled out of this mess. But the coon cuff worked. That's Jay's coon cuff there. Coon. But the coon cuff worked.